Hello everyone, it's Mel from Everything Marmy. Welcome to Thursday the 14th of March 2024. I'm trying something different today. I've got my headset on with the microphone arm uh, right down near my mouth because wouldn't you know it, there is a whole heap of construction literally right outside my front driveway. And I, uh, I am hoping that this technique of using this microphone this way is going to block out all the noise. And if it doesn't, I apologize in advance. So today I thought I would do a, a very chill video um, laying down the week from March 11th to the 17th in the Hobonichi Cousin. Um, this is how last week turned out. We had set everything down together and I'd filled it in, populated it all, all the steps, oh, except for Saturday and Sunday, which could be remedied, and walking, water, meals, all of that. So this time I did get a little bit wiser and chose some washi. Now these colors may look like odd and they feel odd. Oh gosh, are they breaking up the concrete too? They don't give notice. They gave me exactly, I don't know, I, I got the slip this morning in, in the mailbox and didn't see it on the floor until I went to go check on the raccoons. Um, so yeah, otherwise I would have warned you all or done this like at the crack of dawn, seriously. Um, they didn't even put it, they must not have put it in my box until, well, it is 8.49 now. So I, I, I don't even think they gave me an hour notice. So yeah, that's unfortunate, but, um, the show must go on. Let's get those dates in there. And I'm just using it for my medical weeks because I keep track of everything in here. And let's see, what date was that? 9th and 10th. And when you know it, I don't have the 9th and 10th in here. I mean, what is going on, Mel? Okay, where is your book? Where is your book? We have to deviate a little bit. Now I've had a couple of requests um, on doing a process video on these pages. Yes, I will. Absolutely. And I'm behind on here too. Look at that. We are here. Okay. That will not do. So if you get a little uh, sight of my head or my microphone or whatever, and it makes me look like an alien, folks, I apologize. These hearts, if you're new, just indicate that I am very grateful to be alive and breathing air um, on this day. Is it the 14th? Yeah, I did say that. Um, I use two distinctive colors. I use the 772 Tombow and the 055 Tombow. The yellow indicates me walking every day and the um, beautiful pink indicates just love, which I try to focus my attention on more than any other emotion is love. My grandson is a year old tomorrow, guys, a whole year old. I um I can't believe it. So there we go there. Uh now what were we doing? We were checking the walks from the ninth and tenth, correct? Yeah. So weekly where did I track the walks? In the Where are the steps? Here they are. 
Okay, I made a mistake here. Um, this was supposed to be a zero. 10,011, not 111. Um, let, so that's why. Oh, that was 11,011. This was 10,011. See, guys, my eyes play tricks on me all the time. So I apologize for that. Let's get that down in here. Really what I aim for is 10,000 steps a day. Some days are harder than others, but um, at the end of the day, as long as like Friday, for example, I got 8,527 steps. That was the best I could do. And, you know, I have to be pleased with my efforts. And so I pat myself on the back and saying, you know what? I didn't give up. I didn't not go. My back was really bad that day, but I went and I was extremely exhausted. So even if you got, you know, 200 steps today, guys, you know, if you're aiming to do a walking routine, that 200 steps is 200 steps more than you had before. So, you know, anyway, that, that was last week, just for a sneak peek the week before the week before that and that Valentine's Day was kind of really simple wasn't it and then the week before that okay so you can see my style essentially so what I thought that I would do because I pulled out oh now we got sirens my goodness sirens and everything I pray everybody's okay. So I pulled out all of these um, kits that I have from Busy Bee Planners, Pooky Bear Cuties. There's not many left. And uh, even though I said I wasn't going to do any more kits, I lied, folks. I lied. I'm a liar. <laughs> I, um, I couldn't help myself. I just think her kits are just um, phenomenal. She's a Canadian. Um, artist. I like to support some shops and I was running low and each book seems to have its own style so I wanted to engage in that. Um, use up what I have of course which I have been doing. So I do plan on using up the myriad of um, leftovers here. I've got some quarter boxes, some half full boxes. Are these half boxes? Yeah, I think these are half boxes, full boxes. I have some decorative stickers. I have um, lists and some beautiful little decorations here, the weekend, some trackers. Um, some little, uh, what does that one say? It's in yellow, so it's really hard for me to say. Home day, day, day off, laundry day, fry day. <laughs> Makes me feel like fish. <laughs> uh, pay bills, trash day, don't forget. Okay, so, and then I, I didn't know which numbers I wanted to use. I'm, I'm kind of leaning towards these ones. There's some more boxes and these numbers. And then I'm going to use these covers for the top. And then even though these are like super thin. Oh, is that a full box? Okay, that must be a full box. But these ones are like, like super thin. So that's weird how there's a full box there. Um, so we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna do what we do and see how this will come out. And because I have no idea at this point, um, I know I want to put the date covers up there. Some trackers along here, very similar to here. Let's make sure you guys are in frame and 
the number ones that I want to pull out from. I really think I want the bold numbers over these ones or the pastel ones. Need those. And those. And that is a box. That's so weird that they put the full box there. Okay. So we'll move those to the side. I've got the tweezers ready in case I need them. I don't know what I'm going to do about my nails, guys. I keep whacking them. Um, when I got the glue on them, of course, it ripped the nail polish off. <laughs> oh, you know... Uh, thank you for um, Pamela Creates, I think, for telling me about the spatula, reminding me, actually. I knew about the spatula. Uh, I'm just lazy, honestly. So, what do we want to do? They are going to drill. Guys, I am so, so sorry if this video turns out to be a whole lot of thumping and bumping. Where are those date covers? There they are. So, I wanted to, to kind of try something a little wonky, which is generally what I do anyway, but I didn't know if I want to do it like the pink down and the blue at the top. I think that's what I want to do. Where's the ruler? Excuse my hand, guys. This is the other thing. I have a hard time, like, seriously grabbing these things up. Okay. I hope you have a drink of coffee or tea or whatever. I'm sorry if I have to drink water. I will move this microphone so you, so you don't hear me while I do. I am, um, as most of you know, that I'm on this particular medication and I must like inhale this water like no tomorrow and yet um, if I drink it too fast, it's disastrous. So um, let's all cheer for medication, shall we? Can you hear the sarcasm? <laughs> oh, some days, you know, some days, folks. Um, they're doing a, the construction I'm talking about now, they are planning to make the area where I live fit something like 13 to 20,000 more people. And so at every turn, literally in this very small area of town, there is construction, literally. And I apologize for how many times I'm going to be laying this washi down because I can't seem to get the end lined up. Yeah, so they've put up four buildings already and they need to have them all ready by next summer. And yet we have very little like resources um, in, in terms of grocery stores or uh, parking or facilities. So um, I'm hoping that it, if they construct these buildings uh, underneath, they'll put shops and parking underneath them, you know, um, because our city wasn't meant to be a city. It was meant to be a fort. It was actually known as Fort Victoria. And it was meant so that the queen, during World War II, could come and hide out if the Germans advanced too far. And we have a castle called Hatley Castle that was built specifically for her that turned into a military um, officer's cadet 
uh, training and then after that became um, let's see what I'm doing here guys just one second yeah after that became a general college when the funding kind of got cut so and when I was in military housing, it was beautiful. It was down by the ocean, literally, like you could walk. My most favorite place. And I remember before all the bands, the fire bands, taking my guitar with my kids and uh, lighting up a beach bonfire, you know, and letting them roast weenies and marshmallows and making s'mores and I'd play the guitar and people would join us and that's just how it was like you know the more the merrier we'd have a grand old time you know that was my my kind of entertainment and then they banned uh burning of wood on the beaches and then they banned all fires and turned it into a bird sanctuary because of the migration of certain birds that land there and also a plant plant sanctuary of certain plants that grow there that grow nowhere else so a lot of things happened and then our city right now is turning into um, basically a bicycle city where downtown especially has outdoor cafes everywhere and the streets are narrow to begin with because like i said they were not ever meant for vehicles they were meant for a horse and a cart and um i wonder if i could no i can't um and i'm not very far from downtown like if i was to walk literally i could walk there probably well if i'm at my best like if if i'm not you know dragging my body i could get there probably in half an hour let's say that's that's being generous if i'm not having any issues with my body at all um so i'm very close to the water So I just thought I'd add some little like gold touches today. And um, I usually put down the date days first, but I, I wanted to drop this washi down, add a bit of like gold and I'm feeling like this day needs a little bit of extra charm in it, which is why I wanna use the gold. And I'm just sort of putting it down. That one looks like a little bit destroyed at the end. If my vehicle's blocked in, I guess I'm bussing it today <laughs> to my appointment. So I have to take note of that. Um, I didn't really like go over the letter as much as I should. I, I should go get it actually. Um, but I don't want to do that with you guys on camera. Um, I'm sure they said the 15th, which is tomorrow. So. Oh, and I got to think about that because I won't be able to get my car out at all. And my daughter's having a birthday party for my grandson. So. I better look at that. I, do you guys mind if I just run and grab that from my fridge and check? Oh, I pray that this microphone is working okay. I pray. Guys, one second, okay? I know you can hear me as I walk away. That's the great thing about these earphones. is to check this form. Look at this, they just gave it to me today. We will be paving the section, Wednesday the 13th, the 14th and the 15th. They just gave it to me today. Look 
Okay, my road will be closed to all traffic on March 14th. That's amazing. Okay, so that's what I mean. You know, we, we don't get notified of this stuff. So my car is essentially blocked in. And tonight, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna have to go and park my vehicle somewhere else completely and it's all like um like you'll get a ticket to park anywhere so uh, i i think it's crap <laughs> personally but you know whatever okay let's see these ones will fit won't they i'm pretty sure they will no sense in complaining no sense All right, let's get them in here. Now, the reason I don't do these at the beginning of the week is because I have plenty of other books that I do. Now, if this was my only planner, my only book, of course I would. But it isn't. So I always know that I can go to the EDC everyday carry and grab this information and that makes it tremendously convenient and I don't mind doing that because each book has its own personality if you will and I like that about how I'm doing them you know uh, I wanted this book as a book of record basically and that this bulk in the back pages is why I had to create a different kind of book because I'll break the spine literally if I keep this up. Um, I think next year I'll get the Avac. But even then, this is still two months and Avac is six months. So it would almost be good if they did quarterly books, but... Um, I just love the paper, you see. And I don't know, there's just something about getting used to a book that, you know, I had one in 2020. I did some orders in 2021. Um, I didn't do them in 2022. Did I? I didn't, I don't think so, no. 2022 and 2023, I kind of like, 2023, I picked back up. So yeah, 2022, I didn't do. Um, I was like more heavily engrossed in my other hobby and my other hobbies, as well as, you know, um, not feeling the greatest. So I was not doing these particular books, but I was like keeping notes in a different way and um, more personal ways. There, that gets rid of the red. Okay, let's get some numbers down. So, did I order from Hobonichi this year? Yeah, I think I did, didn't I? Gosh, guys, you know what? I don't even remember. I'm still struggling, still struggling with that memory issue. Um, and that was from August, for heaven's sakes. Like I keep saying to myself, one day it'll just go away, but... Okay, for some reason this sticker doesn't want to separate from here. Yeah, from August. And I guess I lost quite a bit of oxygen. 
Um, lucky for me, my daughter was staying over. And so when she found me unconscious, I wasn't out for very long. And then I came to and insisted <laughs> that we go to breakfast. And, um, and over breakfast, which I didn't eat, she said, I, I made her eat because she was insisting I go to the hospital. And I said, well, if we're going there, you've got to have a good meal. It's going to be a long day, right? <laughs> so it's like, I guess there was like, it was this nice little diner called the Sunnyside Cafe. They do these wonderful like waffle meals. And, um, but she said I didn't eat very much and I was kind of like spaced off, but yet guys, I was still driving. Yeah bad and then so we get to the hospital and I apparently was helping somebody else beside me who was like suffering with a lot of GI pain uh, I remember slightly that now but I could not hold on to my phone my phone was so cracked up yeah it was like something else altogether whole different kind of experience that all right let's see if we can get some boxes down for some of these appointments one two three four five six seven eight nine but how many am i gonna lay down I need to lay down them all. Okay. So I had one on Monday. These are very pretty. Now they're going to be a bit bigger. And I get to the point where I don't really care <laughs> that they're a bit bigger. And if I have to scatter them up, it doesn't matter to me. You know, like that one there. I want something to ping kind of off the uh, off the gold. There's this orange one here though. I think I want another floral one though. So tell me, what is the story that you have that you keep going back to in your mind because it just blows your mind that it happened to you? Um, because this experience really blew my mind, obviously. Um, and one of the reasons that it does is because I wasn't, I had apart from a very slightly raised fever, which I've had for over uh, two years. Every day I take my temperature, every single day. Um, and it has to do with something else completely. So when you have these mixed kind of things going on, right, you don't really um, take note of it. But I had no coughing or anything, guys. Like, it was just crazy. So, and then I was walking too. The only thing I noticed was tiredness, a lot of tiredness. Now in here, I wish there was like a little stubby box or something. There kind of is, if I did these these way. Oh God, they're gonna be banging. Guys, I am so sorry. I'm 
just going to hmm, put it down here, even though it wasn't quite like that, but Yeah, it's kind of a mellow kind of video today. I had a, a late kind of start. I can't put that one down, so I'll leave that one out. Um, this one, I'm going to put a big blue box. No, orange. there and I I'm sure they're all crooked <laughs> I'm sure they are all oh, right let's see and then there's going to be this is going to be a lovely weekend, you guys. Oh my gosh, I am so excited for it. Um, okay, let's see one. Two. These ones, these bigger ones are something else. Uh, just checking my calendar, guys. Friday. Yeah, there's something else going on here. So we've got to put it up here. Okay. Now let's add some beautiful stickers. Get this thing. I love these leftovers. So it's essentially I have like two of these purpley ones. So because I do, I'm gonna balance out And it doesn't matter to me if it comes down over the gold a little bit. Each week is so different. I'm hoping you guys can see it. Do you remember when I cut the chicken in half? <laughs> okay, so this one, I'm going to put here, just because I just love the vibrancy of it. to be cut, hey? Eh? Sure. But then that could be a box on its own, so I will keep that, because you never know. Okay. Same with these ones here. They have to be cut down a little bit. And that allows me to get at some of the paper too. I wish I could put this one down here because it's kind of ironic. Um, but I'm going to put that one there. So maybe I'll put this one down here. Here maybe? Yeah. And then I'm going to put this one up here because it's... I'll put a little note on it saying it was not at all this quiet, but 
if you have inner peace, you can make it quite. <laughs> and then, I think what I'm gonna do is cut around these shapes. The odd thing is, is not only is there construction here at my place, but where I'm going for my appointment, there's very loud construction there too. And they do drilling there too. So during my entire appointment, there's drilling, um, <laughs> which drives my therapist completely crazy, completely crazy. Um, you know, it's been going on over a year there. So, yeah, our whole city is just being uprooted. It's very expensive to live here, but it's very expensive to live everywhere. And that's the sad reality. Okay, what do I want to do? Yeah, I think I just want to put that over top of there. I'm all about the decorations, guys, and making things pretty. You know, whether or not I'm the one making them pretty or I'm using stickers to make them pretty, it doesn't matter. I just, I want to bring out the beauty. There's so much ugly, you know, that I just want to focus on the beauty. You know, I guess you could say I'm a Mr. Rogers kind of girl. <laughs> and, uh... You guys remember Mr. Rogers? I love Mr. Rogers and Sherry Lewis and, you know, those, those, were, those were the days, you know, and happy days and good vibrations, hello blues, nothing can hold you as I hold you. I know the words are wrong, guys, but I, I do that all the time. Hands up if you do it too. <laughs> Comment below. If you take a song that you know is wrong but make it wrong anyway okay same with the umbrella and the bird because i don't have a whole lot of yellow you see in this particular one so i'm just kind of fussing cutting not overly picky but enough So, I'm trying to think now. I gotta get my walk in, and then I've gotta take the bus, which I don't mind, uh, except that if I, um, if I have to stand, it becomes an issue because um, I get kind of jarred around, you know? So it was raining up here. We'll do that. And then, oh, the birdies. The little finch. This doesn't look like a finch. It looks like an owl. But we'll cut it out too. Not sure what it is. What it's supposed to be. You know, the weird thing is, is I could draw this, but <laughs> because I have it in a kit. The thing is about drawing is people think they can't draw. And really what it is, is muscle memory. Once you, um, once you train your eyes to see what actually is, and just continue to do that. I mean, everybody's born an artist, guys. All our children are artists, so therefore we all are, we all were and are artists. Okay, so do I have any more stickers? I do. Good, because I want to put in some more 
I want to put in the week hand up here. I'm just swinging this, you guys. I have never really planned this. Just taking a bunch of old kits, throwing them down. Oh, with my daughter coming, we're going to have tea for sure. We will have tea for sure. That's our thing lately is doing it on beautiful like teacups and you know, I think it's a lost art, this old teacup. Get a little, there's my little tweezies. Make a little ceremony of it, you know. Oh, look at this little lamb. This is supposed to be, um, well, it's supposed to be, it is um, St. Patrick's Day. But, you know, as far as St. Patrick's Day goes, I don't really do a whole lot. So the only thing really I can do to indicate that it's St. Patrick's Day is say, like, take these hearts here and my ruler here. Do that and then use the bottom part here as a to-do list because I don't plan on doing a whole lot not with my daughter in town look at that all oh, these books I love them books and bows flowers. See those on my walks. Oh, there's a creamer. I almost forgot the creamer. I guess we'll put a bow up here. And too bad there wasn't a pen. I mean, I could find one. So how are you guys doing? You guys doing okay? I should clarify yesterday when I said that, you know, I won't answer. Um, when I was talking about mental health and I was, you know, um, when I listened back on it, it, made it sound like I like you could send me an uh, Instagram message and I wouldn't answer. It's not correct. I'll acknowledge every single one as long as it's sent in um, a positive fashion. If it's sent in anger or a negative, I won't. Um, if it's a mental health concern and it's out of my league, I'll refer you on. Uh, by that I mean I'll say you know there are services that you know because I'm I'm not I am not a qualified mental health caretaker in any way I do write for mental health yes when I'm not on a sabbatical um, it's been a passion of mine I've done a ton of research but that doesn't make me an expert in any way shape or form guys and um, but I when I said that I am here for you I do mean that. I am here for anybody who feels they have nobody. And even those that just want to um, speak, be heard, talk, um, that's perfectly okay too. Um, and if I don't get back to you guys right away, I do I truly apologize because um, I do have an extremely busy schedule, but at the same time, um, at the same time, I, I think busy people know how to um, 
I actually put that down on the wrong day. Um, busy people know how to manage their time. Um, I don't necessarily consider what I do managing time. I just go with it and, but I do thrive in a chaotic <laughs> lifestyle. Uh, my whole life has been chaos. So I've learned to thrive in chaos. And so therefore I'm able to um, perform better in chaos and act uh, quickly in chaos where a lot of people don't, they freeze. I don't. Um, and because of that, I have severe and complex PTSD. However, what happens with that is that, um, is that once everybody else has calmed down from the situation, whatever crisis may have happened, and I've seen a few, um, then that's when typically I get hit with it. Home day, we're gonna have a home day. My daughter and I on Sunday for the most part. For the most part. Um, happy mail should be coming in today, my Amazon order. Oh, guys, I've been, like, bad. Bad, bad, bad. <laughs> I was good for so long, and then I'm like, yeah. Um, what is today? Happy mail. Yeah, let's get that down here. But if no mail can come down the street, then it won't be today. Trash day was Tuesday. But that's not when I take it out. And I'd taken this off and laid it back down. And now I don't know if I can use it. Oh, maybe. Come on, baby. If you talk sweet to these stickers, I swear they hear you. <laughs> we used to uh, we used to talk sweet to a machine that didn't want to work. And if you talk sweet enough to it, it would work. It was so funny. Um. I do have to take out the trash. So I'll put that there. Day off. Uh, yeah. I do like to use these stickers up. Uh, sleep in. My daughter will be doing that. But I've been doing that as well. When did I do that? Oh, I'm just going to say, no, I didn't sleep at all. I'm going to say my daughter's going to sleep in. Because I know she will. And you can't really see them. Pay bills. Do I have any bills this week? I don't think so. Day, no, don't forget. Right, I know. That was this one here. On the 13th, don't forget. Right here. And is that everything? Maybe I have time to actually fill it in. I'm just showing you what I'm doing, guys. I'm sorry. Like it's, it looks like there's not much going on, but... Oh, where are the balloons? Where did I put the balloons? bedding. I've got to take it off of there. Oh my goodness. 
this. What time are we looking at? We're doing really good for time. It's so funny, you know, how if you can, there's the things, if you compare construction, you might want to would that really pop? I wonder if those red ones were added. Um, if you compare construction here in Canada to say, I don't know, another country like in the East, we take forever, seriously. And they get what they get done in two weeks takes us a year or two years. I don't understand it. Okay. Now, I did watch last night a bit of a sh um, Kung Fu Panda 2. <laughs> I want to kind of put that down. And, um, yes, I pulled out my credit cards because I did some ordering. When did I do that? It's right here, I guess. Well, we'll put it here. Those are bright. Well, wow. and shoes for walking. Why not, right? the day I had the coffee, guys. Do you guys remember? I didn't stay down. I think it was Wednesday, Tuesday. Pretty sure. But I'm just gonna, yeah, put it there. And what is this? Doctors? When am I not at the doctors, honestly? <laughs> I should just cover it all with doctor stickers. Uh, cleaning, that's today. Boy, oh boy. That is today. Priority. And then this computer. That is just going to be here. And what is this supposed to be? Okay, does anybody know what that sticker is? Is that groceries? Oh yeah, that's groceries. Okay. Sorry guys. Um, I did go yesterday, but I'll just say I... Actually... I'll do that because when my daughter, for when my daughter comes. And then I'm just going to put down some flowers. Let's see, are those all attached? No, they're separate. Good. So this kind of like really makes it pop. You know, it almost makes me think it should have like red like washy or something in it but that beeping would drive me nuts if I had to listen to it all day thank god I have to go out um cart all right what was important about any of these days over the top important? Nothing really. Oh, here. I always send my daughter her fare to come over. 
Um, and I'll just put a little box beside that. I should actually lift that up and do it the other way. Yeah. Um, I mean, she's making the effort to come here, so um, I definitely do that for her to take the ferry to come over. And um, we're going to make that important because it is. We're going to try to go to a movie. I haven't been to a movie since 2019, you guys. 2019, and I think it was Cinderella. Okay. Yay! Finished a page. Okay. What are we doing? 56 minutes. Yay me. Okay, so we can fill in some of this stuff. And I pray you guys can hear me well. What are we doing on my clock, which still hasn't moved forward? 9.44. Um, I like to use a really dark ink, but I can't remember which one is dark. And I, you know, everything's gel, and I prefer ballpoint. I just do. Even the Salami pen, I don't find the ink very dark. I wonder how it'll work. Well, let's try it. I need to get more uni balls because, like, the uni ball things, because sadly my ink has run out. And I forgot to put it in my cart. And now to order like just that would be silly. Yeah, see my black has run out. My blues are run out. Like, so I've got pens. <clears throat> okay, so Monday. Tuesday. It's kind of boring, isn't it, you guys? I'm so sorry. <laughs> like, really? But this is planning, right? Like, a lot of... Um, So you know that car accident that I was in, guys? I got amnesty from it um, because I've never been in a car accident before in my life. So my insurance did not go up at all. Um, and in fact, the cost of the damage to the other vehicles was extremely low. And thank goodness nobody was hurt. So thank you guys if you were praying for that experience because I... I was worried, you know, about the middle girl because when I text her, she hadn't gotten back to me and I, I was concerned um, for her safety, you know. Yeah, it really was something getting my foot caught beneath that, between that brake and the gas pedal. Um... And I also I've been canceling this HelloFresh box every week because I have so much food. Okay. 
and then Friday morning. Is that the one I can't put in? That's the early morning monster, that one. Okay. Well, we'll just put the trash day. I mean, trash day is kind of appropriate, to be honest. Oh, well. A whole big tape down there. Um, I'm wondering, yeah, I should put that sticker up there. No, I don't want to focus on it, but. I'll just line it up in there. Okay. And this is my grandson's birthday. His name is Atlas. Okay, and then on the weekend, um, wake Olivia, and then um, e transfer funds, and then pick her up at ferry. And then shopping and lunch. She wants to go thrifting actually. It's kind of a favorite pastime we do. Then we'll come home for tea and have a re uh, relaxing evening. As for all of this stuff, guys, I'll fill in all of that. And then she will likely sleep in, which is what it says here, but you can't really see it. Um, and day off. And then we're going to the movies. Let's go to the movies. Sorry, guys. <laughs> and then this one here. Um, okay, steps. Steps, steps, steps. Where are you? And then that's about it. Oh, this one is walking. And guys, I have to start with my vitamins. My goodness. Um, and then this is water very important and then I gotta track vitamins I know I do but like I uh, keep forgetting so 11th where is the 11th oh somebody was asking me where I got this calendar I I, I just screenshotted it from Pinterest I just typed in 2024 March calendars and this came up. I took a screenshot because that's my ability. And then I just printed it out on an A4 size because that's my ability <laughs> and cut it out. So that's where I got that calendar. Okay. Um, Here's my steps here. And actually the weather, I want to put the weather in too. So 10, eight, six, seven, and it was definitely like overcast. 11, oh, two, four, it was and down rain. Actually, it was peeing down rain on Monday. 
and then yesterday it just started to clear up. Two, one, two. So it was kind of a combination of clouds and sun and rain. And now today is supposed to be just a little bit of clouds, but a whole lot of sun. So I'm super psyched. And just to give it some color, <clears throat> so I can come along with like um, my gel pen after and not have to worry that, you know, it's going to be so boring. I'm just going to fill in the pages with some pink and some greens and just kind of alternate it, make it a little bit colorful. Not worry about filling it all in exactly. These are Tombos. This color is 723. I wanted to write down Kung Fu Panda 2 because we might be going to the fourth one. I thought it was a second one. Uh, where do I want to put this? Here. Oops, sorry about that little goose. And a little pink up here. Put some pink down here. The weekend tends to be kind of put in together. That'll be green. We'll do some of this in pink and some in green. And because that's green already. Usually I like a three color system. But Okay, this one needs a little bit here. Okay, maybe a line here. Okay, and then I come along. And because um, I'm going to use now a mild liner because my um, my Tombos are, I don't have a light one like this, and I don't like the darker ones. But I do like this mild liner. So, you know, it is sort of like, I don't know there's a theme for St. Patty's Day. I don't know. Um, like I said, it's, it's sort of not one that I really celebrate. And in fact, like the older I get, the, the less I really celebrate holidays as such as more so celebrating every day. Um, because I just feel like we jump from holiday to holiday and you know, like maybe that's great in the sense of giving everybody something to look forward to. But like, you know, like obviously Easter, right, is coming up. And, but like spring vacation and things like that. Like I, I told one of my doctors, I don't even know when that is. She's like, well, don't, don't, don't your kids tell you? And I don't know, maybe they just think I know. <laughs> I don't know. So it takes me, obviously, a lot longer than most people to do a spread, but I do it really chill. I do it really relaxed. I um, 
I think most people, well, I'm, I'm not going to speak for most people, sorry. Um, but I think for me, I just enjoy it that much more when I take my time. And um, so I prefer to do it that way. And like I said, I really pray that you guys haven't been hearing that beeping the whole way through. I'll find out on my walk, but, um, so this is a sticker thrifting. Cause it looks really like white and bare. I gotta do something with that. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Let's get some of the darker pink in here. Well, I think that will wrap it up for my week of the 11th to the 17th of March. We are here today and now I have to go do my walk and um, remember folks please that we are all perfectly imperfect and you are loved and needed and wanted far far more than you will ever know. Please have fun today. Try. Um, feel encouraged. Feel that you're loved. I mean you are loved really. Um, if you're having a hard day, I hope that you feel better. Um, my thoughts and prayers are with you. If you're having an excellent day, I am so happy for you. I'm sorry I'm shaking the camera. And um, for everybody, please remember the most important thing is that you're safe, your family is safe, and that you have a blessed and beautiful day. Bye, everyone. Speak to you next time.